a very quick video on how to change out the uh, motor mount inserts on a 93 GMC uh, 6.5 turbo diesel one ton frame I don't think it matters um, they're pretty much uh, gonna be the same I believe in the 6.5 but uh, anyway this is energy suspension from Leroy diesel dot com Leroy is a great guy he uh, will give you good good prices on good products and the energy suspension is one of the best it's a urethane uh, motor mount number 3.1152G. Um, if you need to know the part number, made in America, that's always a good thing. Um, this is uh, the motor. It's I've already got this pulled apart, but I went ahead and set the uh, the old mount back in there. You can see how this thing was squishing over to this side. I think the other one was way worse too, but uh, um, it was really causing some some uh, some havoc there. Various different problems as far as vibration the motor motor was just moving around in there and uh, was misaligned my pilot bearing was toast causing some alignment problems into my uh, NB4500 manual transmission anyway so um, first thing you want to do um, is to uh, drill out your uh, your old old mount um, in uh, three spots Two here, one down down below here, are going to be riveted, basically. And uh, you just need to drill those out. You can use uh, probably 7, 6, I, I think I used a uh, 13, 30 seconds. Just, I was just going above a 3 eighths. But anyway, probably 7, 16 or below around in that area. We'll probably drill those right, right out of there. And uh, this thing will just pop right up apart. Um, it was not nearly as pretty as it is. I went and slammed a coat of paint on this thing um, after I took a, a wire wheel to it. It's always good, man. Uh, go through your nuts and bolts and clean them up so that uh, if you ever have to get back in there, it's a little bit uh, more pleasant job, easier job. So you've got your pieces apart here. Um, and after you clean them up, um, this is the uh, configuration you want to be looking at it uh, with the offset up. You got uh, your two fairly flat here with the with the shallow dimples on the bottom, and then your taller uh, 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 impressions on the top, and putting the offset up. So that's the orientation that you want to be looking at this thing. And then you take your uh, energy suspension number three point one one five two G, and uh, the orientation is this way if you'll notice that this tab here is a lot smaller than this one is about five eighths I think and you want the larger one on the right and towards the top yeah so you can have it backwards there you can have it on the on the bottom there or of course you can have it swapped around this way so you just want the five eighths on the top and again this is with the larger uh, indentations on the top and uh, the five eighths tab up and to your right and that's how it will go into the insert and then what I am going to do they give you these they give you the tie wraps to hold it down and that may or may not work but uh, you've got a bit of a bit of a gap here so all I did was I took my uh, nuts and bolts that originally mounted it down and uh, I cleaned them up real nice uh, wire wheeled them and I'm just gonna put these in and what I'm gonna do is uh, let's see it. I'm weld welding these two, so I want to have a bolt in here. And these uh, nuts are uh, compressed nuts, so I can you can't get them all the way down finger tight. So just to, uh, I'm not going to get this all on camera because I'm making this a quickie and uh, get into welding and stuff like that. And that's, I'm not uh, prepared to do any sort of a uh, how-to on that guy welding scene. Um, but what I'm going to do is go ahead and put these in and then uh, I will uh, tighten them down a little at a time because what I what I want to avoid is cinching down one side and then clamshelling it and having to mash it down and it's all misaligned. I'm going to, I'm going to uh, tighten it down a little at a time so these holes are lined up as well as possible and now you know that might be a detail that doesn't need to be there but I just uh, feel better when things are all lined up right so I'm going to uh, mash this down little by little it'll be secure and then I'm going to put it in my vise and I'm going to weld up these holes um, I believe you can use the bolts and just bolt it down from what they said but I don't I don't know it's that's a little fishy to me so um, I'm just going to go ahead and put a put some a weld around in there 
and uh, make her make her done and permanent. And that way, if I ever had to do it again, which is uh, not likely at all, period. But I could just drill out the weld and start over, and you're you're good to go. So um, that's it. As soon as I get her all welded, then she's going to be done and pretty and um, super solid, man. These uh, these urethane mounts are good ones. So there you go. Um, your your proper orientation on the energy suspension. 3.1152G.